Hello, today's the day the sun is shining, the tank is clean, and I am gonna move all the stuff around in my room. Let me show you what it's looking like right now. Oh, but first, if you haven't watched the previous two episodes of my little minimalism series, you probably want to, to know what's happening at all right now. Alright, let me show you what it's looking like. So, as you step in the room, there's my bed kind of messy. I'm really sick of trying to make it while it's pressed up against the wall. It's not easy. Little nightstand. There's my dresser. It's all empty now. And here is all of the stuff that was on my walls and the bookshelf and all my decorations and stuff that I'm keeping. And then my dog's cage, of course. And over here is some more stuff that I'm getting rid of that's currently for sale. So since last time, obviously I've removed everything off of the walls and I have separated it into stuff that I want and stuff that I don't want. Patched all the holes in the walls, painted them this morning, and I had some time left over today because it took less time than I thought it would, so I thought, let's just do it. Let's just get this all out of the way and over with. So, time to start moving furniture around.
it's finally done. I love it. It's so much more peaceful and like easy to navigate. Um, when you walk into the room, you aren't running into like a giant Ottoman footstool thing. Um, I get to make my bed on both sides. I'm so relieved. I just feel like it has just a way better flow in here. So let me show you the final product. So here's what it looks like when you walk in. And immediately is my dresser. And all I have on here is stuff that I use to get ready. And then I have like necklaces and colors hung up. So in a mirror. So it's like just getting ready area. And it's also where I film my drag videos on my other channel. I've got my painting here. It was kind of smushed onto that wall. I was moving castle posters in the same place. My nightstand moved over to this side of the bed. And then I've got my horror posters up. And then my bed is in the middle. This bedding is from Pillow Fort. And this darker gray thing right here my mom made for me. It's like um, a weighted blanket for anxiety. And here's the little bookshelf that was in my closet. And those are all the books I kept. So that's all I own now as far as books. I could not part ways with the entire series of Unfortunate Events series. And then these are all sort of like my decor items that I kept. The cedar chest stayed in the same place the whole time. It still has that blanket on it and the cat bed. My Spirit Away poster moved. There's the two closets. And the little clock didn't move. I will insert some before and afters as well so you can remember what it used to look like alongside with what it looks like now. Um, but other than that, this is just kind of like a brief overview tour for this video. I will be making a more in-depth, like, minimalist bedroom tour in the future. Um, but yeah, so far, like, I'm way happier with it. It's not giving me that same sort of, like, overcrowded feeling that it was before. And I did want to mention, because I've been talking about my tiny house this whole time, Yes, this is the stuff that I want to bring my tiny house, like, my whole room is what's going to fill up a whole house. And I know that even with this amount of stuff, I'm going to have to minimize again, so this was really like round one. Although, maybe more like round eight, because I've definitely done this a few times before, but I think that I made pretty good progress, and I'm interested to know what you guys think, so let me know in the comments, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.